Hello, my friends out there in YouTube. Um, I was just out here. This is uh, Point Place, Ohio, where I live. Um, I thought Amazing Sky, and I thought I'd go shoot myself a sunset video or just a little bit of a pre sunset. It's going to go down about another 45 minutes. So I went up, pulled drone out, took her up to about 100 meters in the air, and I didn't even realize this until I brought it inside and looked. This is not coming from the reflection on the camera lens, because you'll see the drone shaking back and forth and that, and this stays stationary in the sky. But look at the perfect right angle. And I've showed this on past videos on the webcams, that something here is creating an exact right angle, breaking the light. Then over here, you have this brighter glow coming. This is red, and you'll watch this appeared to be spinning. I still believe it's overload of the lens, but the catch is there's so much chems in the sky from today that I can stare at the sun. So I don't understand how it's overloading the camera. But here we are, starting out the video. And I'm guessing uh, when I was looking at the remote, I took it up to at the maximum height of about 110 meters. And for any of you uh, people who think, oh, I'm doing stupid things with my drone and all that uh, I never left above my personal airspace above my property never left technically four feet from me above my head and the top flight is over 400 feet is illegal and maximum I had it up to is 110 meters which is approximately about 340 feet so I still stayed well within all your limits and laws for all you drone hounds out there um, but as we're seeing here, now look at the black dot in the sun. Uh, it looks like it's rotating in the middle. Or the whole circle itself is rotating. Which is incredible. Over here, like I said, this isn't on the lens. But as the thing shakes, like the rest of the sun's moving, this is moving exactly the same. So that's not on the lens. Or coming from a camel and I. That perfect right angle there is in the sky. And if you look close, here's another straight edge right there where the light's coming out the other side. And you can see it. I don't know if it's round or straight. But you can see a shadow right there. And you have that telltale bright red fire glow that we've been having here of late. Same clouds right here, the formation. This is always heavily covered. It's been since summer. Check out my video six, eight months ago. You'll see it to be true. This here is always... The horizon, I haven't seen a clear horizon without something from about point where my cursor's at in probably two years now where I've seen, you know, clear horizon. Your sun dog effect or your halo effect. I'm doing myself a 360 panoramic view so you can see everything what they're doing to our skies. This is the Ottawa River and there is our wonderful Lake Erie. These are the power plants out here that are producing that wall of clouds across our background. You can see the chemtail stripes where they've been spraying all day long. This is a rich boy, owns that entire island out in the middle of the river. Must be nice. I, you know, I'm comfortable, but I don't have anything like that kind of money. I still drive an old Ford Ranger and an old Ford Focus. Wife's got the new car. But anyhow, there we are again. There's your straight line. I think there's something right here. It's deflecting the light. You can see there's a right angle still, but there is something definitely there. Then here you can see where the light's broken. That could be just a heavy mass of clouds here causing that, but it also could be an object. Check it out. Still rotating and spinning around. Uh, Jeff P. has brought that to my attention before, and that he believes that that's the center of the sun simulator rotating around. I'm still not sure, but before on my other drone video, if I remember correctly, it was just a black dot. And it was a brighter day out than this by far. So why is today, It I can see the spinning rotation of it, and the last time I could not. And if you look close, the video quality on this drone shoots at 720. So you really can't see... But if you were able to look close, there are stripes throughout this entire sky where they've been dropping chemtrails all day long. Like right here is one where I think they're doing that to mask whatever's right here. They can fuzz it all up so it's all blurry, you can't see through it, and then you can't tell what it is. 
there's trails everywhere and sorry about the glitch my app on my drone froze it kept recording but the picture on the screen stayed still so I had to reset it so that was a little jump in the video where I had to turn the app off and turn it back on so I could get my video feedback and funny thing was like I said it was still recording to the phone but it was just frozen on the screen don't get why it wasn't connected that way because it was still connected to the phone so I had to turn the app off turn it on hit the recording again but here I am panning back around and right now I'm at probably about I'm guessing it's about 35 meters in the air and look at how it just keeps getting brighter and brighter like something's reflecting under the Sun it's just illuminating the whole you know horizon directly below it just that glow and fire red it's incredible and there's that circular shadow if you look close right there Oops, sorry about the shaking right here it's always there check out some of my other summer videos of sunsets and that and I'll point this out I've got probably eight or nine different what I call planetary shadow type videos that shows that and I've even went from where I've caught them personally and then went home to the webcams and then verified it on five different cams this round circular shadow and we're talking webcams that are as far as 500 miles away from each other verifying it not a webcam that's you know 20 miles from each other that you can pick up the same shadow anomaly from a cloud you're not getting the same cloud at two to three four five hundred miles away and apart you won't see the same cloud formations no way and if they do hold their shape and that means there's something else going on you can see we're supposed to have a pretty good snowstorm tonight moving in just one to three inches but it's gonna make it nasty tomorrow morning we just had um, one to two inches last night another one to three Friday to Saturday we're not getting any massive storms we just keep getting smacked around a little bit by a little bit well, all my friends out there on YouTube watching this video I thank you and there's still your right angle right here getting chemmed over where you can't see it video is about to end but here it is landing right in my backyard that's my garage I'm even coming down between the power lines and that and everything well that's neighbor's garage sorry but landing right in my driveway and we'll back this up here's your right angle there's the chemtrail plane that just came through covering it spinning circle fire red glow this isn't normal what's going on there's always cloud formations down to the lower right of the, the sun right here it looks like something's there that's breaking the light that's in the way of the sun another dark super circular shadow there and just bringing you this from point place ohio this is earth watching everyone out there be safe god bless and pre please be prepared to the best of your abilities for whatever might come you all have a good night